Welcome to your reading and this is your July the 29th to July the 31st of 2020. This is for Aries Ascendant, Moon Rising and Venus Placement on their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. So cross watchers, if I describe someone here and you know that it is not you, then it's not you. Okay? Just because you are connecting with Aries, you're going to assume that whom I'm describing here is you. Please don't, this is not a personal reading. For those of you who is new to the channel, you might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a collective reading or I'm doing a live session wherein you can ask me a question. Okay, if you ask a question, please be patient as much as I want to um, cater to all of you. We are on a, um, I mean, there's a time frame, right? But there's always a next session. Patience is needed. If you didn't catch me live, then you can still ask me a question. There's still link. There's a link in the description box, rather. Click that link. You'll be routed to my page. Type in your question and click submit. If you are also if you also want to know your lucky number, lucky color, follow me on Instagram. There's a link in the description box. So Aries, if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, then come back to the reading after a week or two, time is fluid. And if you resonate with some bits and pieces, then congratulations for I am doing a collective reading. Aries. If this video got 300 likes, that your next video will be a full reading. But as of the moment, let's begin. Aries, the full card. And, okay, Aries, someone here may be a little, you know, let's say, because of their emotions, they're going to make a decision here to leave the connection. Um, but the love is there, okay? Did they mean it? Most probably not. Um, someone here will just make a sudden decision to leave the connection. Um, we're going to focus on career, job, but there will be some changes here with regard to this dynamic of yours. Option and the Five of Cups. Option because it could be the other person is looking at someone or something. Option, I have a wheel of fortune travel. Mm. For a few numbers of you, okay? For a small percentage, rather. If you are buy buying a car, okay? Um, there's also a few options that you need to consider here. I just, I don't know, I just need to say it. If you are looking for a car, then there will be some options that will that you need to consider. Um, you deserve that. You, know, you work hard for it. I think you're going to choose something with, it's not about the look. It's something about how you feel. I think that's the, the, the thing that you need to consider. But when it comes to relationship, I can see here that there will be some changes here all of a sudden. Probably someone is looking for option. Someone is also probably just waiting. Uh, someone will, you know, suddenly feel that this is a waste of time. Ten of Cups is here, well, a sudden change, and the Nine of Pentacles, eight and nine. Working hard, whoever this person who's working hard, it could be you or your, um, the person that you're connecting with, will find happiness, will find completion. Um, if this person who left, is this for him, okay, or her, 
uh, everything now, the changes here will be going to a calmer water. The devil card is here, so you might be connecting with a Capricorn or has a Capricorn placement on their chart or you have a Capricorn placement on your chart. But what I'm seeing is if I'm going to connect the full card and the devil card, okay, this is just a sudden move that this person will probably turn their back on this connection. But there will be sudden changes here. I can see that everything will come to go to a calmer water. Is there manipulation in the connection? Or is there a codependency? I think that's needs, that needs to be removed. Um, yeah, I think the deck is stating need to remove the option <coughs> for, for a relationship uh, based reading because someone here might feel like if this codependency still uh, will go on, this person who works hard will leave or turn their back there, um, turn their back in this connection or move a little further. Um, but something here will change. Let's see. Aries, let's check this seven of cups. Or this eight of cups rather. Why this person's going to leave? Nine of Wands. Um, someone is a little defensive. Seven of Cups, really an option. Um, this is a strong depiction that telling you guys that they uh, telling the universe, telling it to you from the universe that there is an option here. Option to travel, perhaps, or option with a person. Now, I want to see the changes. The moon card. You might be connecting with a Pisces or has a Pisces placement on their chart. Or you have a Pisces placement on your chart. It could be an illusion. This relationship could be an illusion. Or there will be a misunderstanding that is coming your way. But everything will go to a calmer water here. Okay. Things will change. If there are misunderstandings, if there are illusions, the sun is here. So everything will... Everything will... This is a promise from the universe though. Yes, there may be some challenges, twists and turns in this relationship. But the sun will always shine here. I think if there are some challenges, both of you are also trying to make this. This wheel of fortune is a quick change. If there are misunderstandings, you're trying also to fix this right away. Sun is here. But I am intrigued with the option here. Option because travel. You might be connecting with a cancer or has a cancer placement on their chart or you have a cancer placement on your chart but the devil card showed up here um yep it's either manipulation or codependency um someone's also trying to control the, the connection here um is it a mind game let's check but five of cups is here Wherein the other person feels like, am I wasting my time on this? The hermit. Um, this thought um, of thinking, am I wasting my time, will be here for quite a while in this connection. That's also probably the thing that needs to be removed um, energetically wise. It may take time before the other person to finally have a an enlightenment here six of swords things will really go to a calmer water it's a promise here you have to make a better judgment um knight of cups the connection might probably be may take a little slow okay but let's see here the devil card something someone is they think they cannot get out of this connection, but the Three of Cups is here, wherein the other person might probably really have the option, or Eight of Swords. 
someone is pushing for someone is pushing for a celebration so the other person might be in a stressed right now and wanted to make this connection come to flourishion Aries, this is your reading. There's a lot of things that's going on here. Um, I think I'm picking up bits and pieces from each and any one of you. But Aries, this is your reading. If you resonate with this and you want to go in depth, you can book a personal reading with me. You can contact me. There's a link in the description box. If you are in this situation, at least bits and pieces, and you want to clarify, you can go ahead and contact me there's a link in the description box click that link you will be routed to my page type in your question and click submit aries thank you so much again 300 likes your next reading will be a full reading please share the video click the like button click the subscribe button smash that notification bell and comment down below i'm very interactive thank you so much for watching love and light to you namaste see you in the next reading goodbye you are the best of my heart.